on where it is. TSC Seeger. Is that what I call the TS Seeger? I'm out riding again. I've been in to save more foods. Got me some stuff. Uh, I'm spending money today, guys. I mean, you gotta, you gotta eat, right? You gotta eat food. And see, man, this town is freaking. There's a theater that used to be here, and it's closed. It's been the building's been empty forever in a day, and they want like a small war bench and just freaking rent it. That's why they can't rent the dang thing. And then, here's a bank. First Tennessee Bank. Closed. Out of business. Just went out of business not too long ago. Gone. Just, uh, like, what the heck's going on? Anything? But, thought I'd give you all another ride here. Ride video. And there's a mighty big watch. And, uh, staples. Man, that's about the gist of this town. We got a little Central Park there, a little Burger Shack. And then you got a Burger King and a Wendy's and Little Caesars. And Wendy's Auto, uh, Advance Auto. And then over here you got another stupid shopping center. It's got a bunch of crap in it. Uh, but that place there, it's been the restaurant. It's been a million different restaurants because nobody can afford to freaking rent on the bill. It's like three, I don't know, five thousand a month for that crappy thing. The building has been there for a hundred years. Oh, where's Mako Corporation? If you've got a grill that says Mako on it, it's probably made right over there. And they make, they used to make chairs and tables too. I don't know if they still do or not, but. Anyway, uh, I was going to ride. I'm just riding. I stopped and got some stuff. And thought I'd uh, take another ride here. And There's a store here run by Pakistanis or Indians, whatever they are. Right there. They sell more freaking lotto tickets than anybody in this town. And you can, people in there get scratcher's disease. You know what that is? Scratcher's disease, that's when you do like that and you shake your head, you know, when you're scratching. And you go, go home and you're sitting at the table eating and your head starts doing that. And if you got an old lady and she slaps the piss out of you, that means you got scratcher's disease. Anyway, so much for that. But, yeah, we're going to make his turn here. Howdy. Hello. How you doing? There's a Volkswagen Beetle. Jump. Made me a honky go. And, uh, we'll get on it here a little bit. Jabbo. Ah, that's what this guy said one time. Cars tore up. I said, what's wrong? What's it sound like? Mmm, Jabbo. I'm like, what's that mean? He said, that's the way it sounds. I said, well, I ain't got no idea what's wrong with it, dude. If it makes a jabbo sound, you need to take it to a jabbo mechanic. You hear that tow wrecker? Anyway, I, I scratch a lottery ticket every once in a while, but right down there is a marathon. That's where I usually get my tickets, but I'll buy one or two. But I went in there two weeks ago, and uh, I had never won nothing big. And I bought two tickets at four dollars, and I scratched, and I won a ticket. Scratched that, that store right there. Scratched, won a ticket. Scratched, won a ticket. And then I played. I'm playing the same ticket too. Traded that in. And guess what I got? Five hundred dollars. Five hundred. And I had just paid a big old emergency room bill work up my leg. So, but anyway. I got 500 of it back, but you know what I did? Them ladies that sold me the ticket, I gave them $40 a piece. There was two of them in there out of that 500. Because I believe you should share your money if you win something. And I did. I mean, it might not have been a lot, but I mean, they work there for minimum wage. I'm guessing $40 come in pretty handy for them. It takes them, uh, what, uh, five, 
five and a half hours to make that much money working there. So, anyway, on my way home, and I just wanted to give you another ride, and I'm just in a big talking mood today and wanted to get some videos out there. They may be bullshit videos, but we're putting them out. We don't care that the mountains are, guys. I see them every day. That's right. Anyway, I'll talk to you later. Peace out, dudes.